Hey guys, now let's talk about expansions. So before the shell carries out your command, it expands it out. For example, the question mark wildcard is expanded to every possible letter. To see what expansions are being performed, we can use the echo command. Echo outputs its text arguments onto standard out. We can use echo to see the contents within our current path. So right now I'm in my home directory and I type echo D and then wildcard and I can see the four files that start with a D. We can also use the echo tilde to expand into the home directory. So I can type echo tilde and, it, and that expands to the home directory path name. So we can also expand now arithmetic expressions. And to do this, we just type two parentheses and a dollar sign before them. So we can have echo, dollar symbol, then two parentheses, five times two, and that'll output 10. And we can use the addition minus asterisk or slash symbol for addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Since we are using integer division, the slash or division will floor any divisions. We also have exponential or and modulo. And lastly, we have brace expansions. If we wanted three files called front A back, front B back, and front C back, we can just type echo front dash A, B, C, and then back. This is very powerful, especially if you want to create a directory with consecutive pattern. So let's say I want to make directories from 2010 to 2014 with all the months in between. So I can do make directory and then 2010, 2014, then 0, and then 1 to 9, then also the 2010 to 2014. And this would be for the months of 10 to 12. So now we can see that we made all those directories. Now imagine doing this on a GUI and it'll take forever. Make sure you can remove these with just remove minus r 20 star. And lastly we can echo out the contents of our variable by just pressing echo and then whatever our variable name is.